even on camera. I love it. Okay. Okie dokie. You've got your air vents. Feel free to readjust if you need to. You've got your e-bags that you won't need. Let's readjust those pedals for you. Put them where you want them. Perfect. Okay. Push awesome. lightly on them. They're beautiful. Okay. Altimeter, G-meter, rear view camera, profile. Neither of these will do much today, but tomorrow they'll be useful. And over there is your speed and mock. You've got a camera over here as well. How's that lumbar sport feel on your back? Pretty good. Feels okay? Yep. All right. And then you are flying out over mountains, so try and avoid watching right where they rush underneath you or you can get a little dizzy. Okay, now you can watch out over the horizon. Mm -hmm. Point your nose at the center of the screen. Any questions about what you're about to do? Nope. Can we just, is it, can this go down anymore? Or? Yeah, it can. It might get a little lumpy under your neck, so let me know if that's uncomfortable. Oh, no, that feels better. Okay. Really good. Yeah. yeah. Make sure it's secure. Yep. All right. Yeah. Hey. All right. No problem. All right, I think we're ready. Okay, instrument panel briefing. Is done. Uh, comp check. John, have you read me? Uh, loud and clear. Would you loud and clear as well? Five point harness. Is on. Uh, red tag. Is down. Lumbar support. Adjusted. Headrest support. Adjusted. Seat height. Adjusted. Rudder pedals. Adjusted. Air vents and e bags. Right where we left them. And looks like we're getting uh, good medical data here. Okay. So you're cleared to close the gondola. Ready to fly? Yes, I am. Thank, Thank you. you. Okay. Now on this uh, this next series of flights, what we're going to do first, we'll bring you up to idle speed. Then we'll take you to 3GX, hold you there for 10 seconds, come back down to idle. Then we'll take you to 6GX, hold you there for 10 seconds, back to idle, then we'll bring you to a stop. Okay, on the GX, uh, for comfort, um, what you want to do is, as you exhale, purse your lips like you're blowing out through a straw. Helps maintain some uh, counter pressure in your lungs, keeps your lungs inflated, just makes it more comfortable. Okay, the room is secure. Getting everybody back on station now. Roger. All right. Okay. Becky, are you ready? Give me one second, Mr. Oh. Okay. Okay, I am ready. Okay, operator, please confirm day one flight three profile is loaded. Day one flight three profile is loaded. Okay, John, are you ready? I am ready. Okay, operator, please commence motion. Okay, we're coming up to idle speed now. Wonderful. Show me visual effects. No, sir. Any dizziness. No, sir. And how's your head feel? Wonderful. Terrific. Okay, we're going to go ahead now and get you set up for the next flight. And uh, operator, please confirm day one flight four profile is loaded. Day one flight four profile is loaded. Okay, John, are you ready? I am ready. Okay, operator, please commence flight. G. 
G's are coming on in three, two, one, now. X, three, four, five, and six. speed and we're going to bring you around to a full stop and yes, as we sir. do that hold your head straight and level please. Yes sir. So do you have any discomfort? No sir. Any just, no, just eyes at the what top of the six you get a little bit watery. Okay. No problem. No visual impairment. No. Okay. No, any pain? No sir. Difficulty breathing? No sir. Uh, how's your heart feel? Wonderful. Okay. Any other visual effects? No sir. Okay. Uh, any dizziness? No, sir. Not, not at all. And how's your head feel? Wonderful. Okay, terrific. Well, we're almost there. So, again, continue to hold your head straight and level. <laughs> so, what did you think of it? I want to do it again. <laughs> you will tomorrow. <laughs> Tomorrow's a fun day. I can't. It is. I yeah. thought today was fun. <laughs> okay. I can't even imagine what's going to happen tomorrow. Um, more fun? Okay. <laughs> all right, keep your head still, okay? Okay, Absolutely. confirm full stop. Okay, Becky, be right down to get you out. Thank you. Please remain in your seat with the belt secure until yes. she gets there. Yes, sir. On October 4, 2007, on the 50th anniversary of the dawn of the Space Age, the NASTAR Center hosted a launch ceremony to open its doors for business to the aerospace community and the world. Astronauts Buzz Aldrin, Anusha Ansari, and Greg Olson come to the NASTAR Center the day before to help launch the facility. They are first given a tour of the center, which features the most advanced human centrifuge in the world. The astronauts then suit up and prepare to experience a simulated space launch. Here we see Greg Olson preparing for his experience by getting situated in a high-fidelity replica of a space cabin. Teammates observe their fellow trainees in the observation room, which offers a full view of the spinning centrifuge and several video feeds showing various aspects of the training. Okay, operator, you're clear to launch. He then launches into space with the aid of a real-world visual database displayed on a wide dome before him, auditory cues provided by a surround sound system, and the authentic sustained G-forces that only the STS-400 can provide. Now it's Anusha Ansari's turn. The loader assists her into her seat and makes sure she is safe and secure for the training session. The operators in the control room monitor the entire process and have several safety systems at their fingertips to ensure the smooth operation of a training run. They are in constant communication with Anusha in the space module. NASTAR-1, you've cleared the stratosphere. Enjoy the black sky. At the top of the room, Anusha feels a slight sensation of weightlessness, an illusion produced by the cessation of launch cheese and manipulation of the gondola at the end of the centrifuge arm. Anusha returns to Earth and is congratulated by the NASTAR Center team and then by Buzz Aldrin. Buzz gives us a thumbs up as he prepares for his launch into space, courtesy of the NASTAR Center. is reminded of his trip into space. How'd that feel? Well, it felt pretty good. Okay, good. <laughs> haven't felt that in a while. There you go. At the end of the training runs, the trainees receive their graduation certificates and earn their spaceflight wings.
three, two, one.